I'm not letting you get out of class no matter how many times you see me. Um, so, um, does anybody know what's the acid and what's the base already here? Can you tell without looking at the periodic table? Does anybody know what this molecule is called here? Nitric acid. Nitric acid, yeah. Nitric acid. Very good. Oh, uh, you shouldn't admit that on video. In organic chemistry, you should know that. Every video. Right okay. uh, Every video, is that what you said? Um, anyway, so what are the products of the following acid-base reaction? So the first thing we need to do is definitely figure out which one's the acid and the base. I mean, we could qualitatively say, because this thing's nitric acid, that it's the acid, right? But we're not really certain about that. How do we figure that out? Okay. Look at the pKa table. Has anybody found nitric acid on the pKa table? Negative one. Negative one. Is that pretty acidic? Yes. Yeah, that's pretty acidic. What is this thing here called? You guys remember from your functional amine. groups? Pardon? I'm going to use an amine. It's an amine. This one in particular is a primary amine. Primary. And that one is 35. Positive 35. Positive 35, yeah. So is that a good base or a good acid? Base. That's a good base. Okay, when they're big, that's a good base. Not to mention the fact you already know that nitrogen with its lone pair wants to attack or grab stuff, you know? Okay? It's a very good base. And that's a very good acid. Amines, amines are good bases. Okay? That's one thing you want to know about amines, that they're good bases. Okay. So, we're probably assuming, I'm assuming already, that it's going to be, the equilibrium is going to be over here. Why? This is a pretty strong acid, this is a pretty strong base. Okay? But let's just prove that to ourselves. So, what's the products here? Let's draw them out. I want you to draw them out on your own. See if you can get them right. If you don't, you know what you need to work on. like silver nitrate or something like that, you know, sodium nitrate. Um, can this thing be an acid? Why not? No proton. Can not be a bronze fed acid? Bronze fed acid. Can this thing be? It's got to be, right? Because we're doing an acid base reaction. So this thing must be the what? Right? So this thing must be the acid. So what is its um, pKa? 10. Plus 10. Plus 10. Okay. So this is the acid. This is the base. So which is the stronger of the two acids? Left. Strong acid. Weak acid. Which way would we expect this to go qualitatively? Again. Right. For the reactants. Why? Because the weak acid is uh, over there, right? So how do we figure out 
a equilibrium constant mathematically? Help me out, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Acid. Over there. Product acid. So, what's the Ka of the reactant acid? Can you guess? Ten to the negative negative one. Negative negative one over the product acid. Ten to the negative ten. So, what's the KEQ? Would you expect it to be bigger or less than one? Bigger. Why? Because the arrow is going towards the product, right? So KEQ, we would expect to be bigger than 1. Is it bigger than 1? You guys know how to do this? That's going to be 1, right? Negative is on the bottom, it goes up to the top, right? So it's 10 to the 11. That's how you do it. Are there any questions? So I think we've done one. Oh, I guess the last thing it says is, which way does the equilibrium lie? To the products, yeah. Okay. Um, any questions on this one? Or So I think we've done one where it to, stays to the reactants goes to equilibrium and goes to products, okay? So I expect that you guys should be able to do all of these types of things. We cool? Cool? Okay, good.